Hi, welcome into my channel. We're about to do a pick a card reading for Aquarius or just for any other sign but my main focus is for Aquarius energy in love right now I want to know uh, I we're gonna find out how your ex feels about you okay so we're gonna use our intuition here so pick a card Aquarius and for all those who are watching here that are interested so you're going to pick a card once from one, two, three. So you're gonna need to focus your intention on the cards. Breathe. Really choose one that is standing out best in your intuition. Choose your favorite number, choose a lucky number, choose the number of the day, whatever works for you. Whatever is sitting well in your emotions right now. And let us get started. How does your ex feel about you, okay? Oh my God. They have an abundance of love for you. This person could be a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. They maybe want to come in and offer love to you. They see you as everything, and so I feel like this person wants to give you everything. This is the golden cup here. This is amazing. This is beautiful energy, purity. I feel like they want a pure, honest connection with you. And yeah, I like that energy for you. Okay, so your ex, some of you, this person could be coming or wanting to come back to you, but they feel like they loved you so much and they feel like you guys shared something really special and I feel like you love this person as well. It's amazing. All right, sorry. For those of you who chose number two, we're going to get into your messages to see how your ex feels about you. Let's go. Oh my God, ten of cups. Beautiful. I feel like they feel like you are a brand new beginning, like a new feeling of love. I feel like this person is also here, a water sign, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio. And this they feel like they could have had a happy home with you, build a life, a marriage. So this was real love, I feel. So you probably disconnected from a person that you did have a family with. So they're not feeling they're not feeling, they're not harboring negative feelings toward you. I feel like they celebrate you. They celebrate the connection that you guys had. Um, I feel like you guys really supported each other. Maybe you had children with this person. Um, maybe they, some, some people want a new beginning with you. Are they, or this is just how they felt in the past. Like they had that bright, brand new beginning with you to start a family. Maybe this was a young family here for your past energy. Okay, now let's get for the third, the guys that picked card number three. Let's see how your ex feels about you right now. Let's go. Oh my. I feel like they're thinking about you. They value you highly. You may have taught this person a lot. You guys may have worked kit together. This is an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This person sees you as grounded and stable. I feel like you guys did things well together. Maybe they felt like you were a bit more focused on your money and maybe not on the connection here. Okay, so I feel like it's good things. I feel like they see you as prosperous, as vibrant, as outgoing. I feel like you also have a Leo in your chart or this person in your past. Um, or maybe, yeah, maybe you are Leo, because I feel Leo energy here for you. So that's it. For further clarification, we're going to pull one more card each from the deck. For those of you who chose one, let's clarify per, um, further your ex's feelings for you. Well, confused, maybe they're confused about coming in. They are not sure how to move forward. Um, maybe they feel a loss in love. They're left in a place of wondering why this happened or how they could have done better. Maybe they had options out there and they chose wrong. I feel something in that sort. But this person was definitely emotionally connected to you. And this was a true union. This was a true partnership between, maybe not a partnership, but this was a true love. Real emotions here. I feel like it got to a point where someone couldn't really choose how to move forward. They couldn't choose how to settle. Okay, so maybe that's why that ended. Let's get to number two. For those of you who chose number two, we're gonna get further clarification for the Ten of Cups energy here, which is a water sign. We're going to see furthermore about your person of the past, your ex. 
oh my this is the card of being broken hearted it's also a card of being stable and grounded so be, you know be mindful of that um, so even though this may have hurt you maybe someone brought a third party into the relationship I feel like this person feels sorry I feel like they feel sorry that they hurt you I feel like they they are sorry that they broke your heart they betrayed you I feel like they acknowledge and own up to the fact that they broke your heart and it was a reckless move I feel like they felt like they destroyed something good that they had going and yeah I feel like this person could possibly have air in their chart an air sign Libra Gemini Aquarius but I feel like they went out and made a decision without thinking clearly and it caused maybe that's what caused relationships to fall apart okay all right let's get for those who chose number three let's see for the clarification for your person your ex let's see mm -hmm. so we have a air sign here Gemini Libra Aquarius I feel like this person had to cut someone out and maybe that was you so maybe you are this person had to break up with you because maybe as I said earlier you were focusing a lot on your money on your job on your business maybe um, a bit self-centered and maybe this was your person's energy too maybe um, yeah so definitely duh, this is your person's energy but I feel like your person feels like maybe you are self-centered or maybe your person was self-centered and focused so much on their money that they weren't giving the connection a fair chance so maybe i didn't say it right in the first place right maybe your person didn't give the connection a fair chance and you had to cut it out you had to move on and really find something that will support you i feel like it's something that you felt like you had to do you had to move on you had to release and let go you had to stand up for yourself here because you know I feel like you did have love for this person but you decided to be grounded and know what it is that you're worth and move on cut I feel like cut your losses and move on I feel like that's how it feels all right so thank you so much I hope you found clarity here in these messages that resonate with you um, please consider subscribing to my channel and I'll catch you next time bye much love to you thank you